what up, what up? Hey, y'all, I want to talk about Las Vegas Raiders head coach John Gruden and NFL's Players Union Chief DeMar Smith. Now, a story that came out today that happened back in 2011 about John Gruden sending an email to, I think it was Bruce Allen, who worked for the Washington Redskins back then. And he was describing DeMar Smith. Now, this is how he described me, calling him Demboris, D-U-M-B-O-R-R-I-S Smith. And he said he has the lips the size of a Michelin tie. Now, John Gruden know better than that, man. But you know, when you think you're doing something in private, you think you can you think you think can get away with it. And you be your true self. You be relaxed. And he just got caught slipping the email and got out there. Now he trying to do do clean up on this. He trying to act like he don't have a racial bone in his body. He all this, he all that. Now I like John Gruden, but he, he, he probably did this, man. You know, I can look at Gruden and tell him, you know, he feel a certain type of way by people. But I think he's a good coach, you know. But, you know, he just slipped and made a mistake. And then it's, it ain't that funny about how long that story been. This is going on 10 years now. It's finally getting all out in the public, man. Now, he since left ESPN. He was working for ESPN when this story broke. He now got the job as the coach of the Raiders. I wonder how the players in the locker room going to feel toward him now. Now they know how he feel toward certain black guys. I believe Gruden said that he didn't like this. I think they were about to have a lockout back in 2011. It was something that the Players Association was fighting over with the league, and he disagreed with it. And that's why he sent this statement out about DeMar Smith. Now, he made, like I said, he made a bad mistake, man. A lot of people are going to look at him side-eyed now, starting with his player. You know, they're not going to have as much love for him as they had in the past. Now, this, this story out, I can't wait to see what Keyshawn Johnson got to say about him on Monday. But I want to hear what you guys think about this. Also, hit that like button and hit that subscribe button.